Hello brothers, uh, welcome to EFS Solutions uh, Practical. Uh, today I will teach you how to confirm graphic chip is faulty. So, and here I have a board. The board model number is Dell 1555 and here you can see FM8 Quanta FM8. Let me show you clearly. Yes, you can see here DA0 Quanta FM8. Okay, this is a hub architecture motherboard. Okay, it has a CPU, it has a north bridge, it has a south bridge also. Okay, Intel. Let me connect the DC power supply. And you can see the ampere, it is showing 17. Now it has gone to 7. Now let me power on the motherboard. I have kept the multimeter in diode mode. Red probe in ground. And black probe, I am going for a trigger. You can see, once I have clicked the trigger, it is going to 877. But the fault is, the fan is not running and there is no display in the pen drive. Okay. How to confirm? See the ampere is 879. Because it is an hub architecture, the ampere should go more than 1.2, 1.3. Let me remove it. Let me show you a shortcut. First, remove the fan connector. In fan connector, <coughs> you can see four wires. red blue black yellow isolate the blue wire like this remove the one end pull the blue wire out you can see i have removed the blue wire you can see now i have isolated the blue wire there are only three wires red black and yellow now let us connect this back i have connected and you can see i have left the blue wire outside okay now let me connect the dc power supply You can see the ampere 17. Okay, let me power on the laptop. Now I am going for a trigger. You can see the fan is running. You can see the fan is running and the ampere has increased. So this is a one clue that the graphic chip is faulty that's why in this FM9 and FM8 Dell 1555 model whether it is an IC, i3, i5 or hub architecture because of graphic chip fault the laptop will not power on or it won't give display. So this is not a BIOS issue, this is not a CMOS issue, this is not a CPU issue, this is not a ICH or anything IO controller. Okay. Now let me show you another clue. Let us remove this. I have removed the fan connector. Keep the multimeter in diode mode. Red probe in ground and black probe you can see this coil. I am keeping the black probe here. You can see the impedance. It is showing me 0 0.003. It is a true RMS. If you are using a normal multimeter, it will show you complete 
triple zero. Okay. See this coil. This is a GFX GPU PWM coil. This is a CPU VRM section GFX core. This will be hidden when you connect the CPU fan. You can see that that coil is hidden and usually you see the impedance here if you this see this gfx core you can see it is showing me 9 means it is okay if i remove the cpu this impedance will come good okay but the graphic chip coil is hidden below this this one so thank you hope you have understood uh, Uh, how to find out graphic chip faulty for more information more core knowledge you can buy fs solutions dvd thank you may god bless you all